he, he did Facebook recently, and he added me on Facebook. We, we started talking. He said, can we meet? I went to meet him, and he said, he said look, Tony, uh, I've been retired for about six years because, sadly, his wife passed away, and he retired for six years. And he said, Tony, listen, uh, can, can, I want to make a comeback. I want to start doing shows again. Can I do shows with you? And I said to him, yeah, of course, uh, that would be great. Like, uh, and that, that's how we started then, about three years ago now. Oh, that's really <laughs> cool. Yeah, that's awesome. That's a great story. Yeah, he used to pull buses and trucks with his teeth. With his teeth. I think the heaviest he pulled ever was about 13, 13 tons with his teeth. Wow. Bus. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty cool. It's, it's, quite, it's different as well, you know, because he does different... He's a different type of strong man, you know, he does with his teeth, he pulls with his ponytail, he used to pull buses and trucks with his ponytail as well, so <laughs> it's different, you know, amazing. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome, um, and I've seen some of the stuff, uh, you know, uh, in the videos, um, he's doing uh, some of the, uh, like the block breaking and brick breaking on the body. With the yeah, 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 yeah. What, what he does, is we, uh, we have, in Malta we have limestone. The whole island is full of limestone, and there's these building blocks. It's a standard building block. It's it's like 40 kilos, and we put it on his stomach, and then we have a trained uh, builder who knows how to break the stone, and he'll smash the stone in half on his stomach, like the old time strongman used to do as well. You know? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that, that's super cool. Um, yeah, that I would I would like to see a, a full show. Uh, that sounds awesome. Um, he also breaks. He also breaks a smaller one on his head. They split it in half on his head. Oh, a yeah. smaller block. block you know, they break it on his head. <laughs> oh, that's cool. It's I quite don't... dangerous, but you know he knows how to. He, he trains. He trains crunches a lot, like six hundred crunches. And he's he's got a strong abdominal, you know, abdominal area, so he can take the blows. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't do it. I would. I would. I wouldn't risk it myself. <laughs> but it's, it's brave. It's very brave. Very brave. Fearless. <laughs> so, um, just from talking to you, uh, you know, setting up the podcast and everything, um, you had mentioned uh, training and, and that you really hadn't been in a, a gym. Um, can you tell us about uh, kind of like how your training is? Uh, just like an overview and, and what you do to prepare for these sorts of things. I, at home, I have like dumbbells or I have some weights and stuff, you know, nothing major. But I mean, mainly I just go out and train when I get a chance. I go out in the field, I lift stones, stone carry, overhead press, uh, stone to the shoulder, even like deadlifts with stones, and mainly stone, stone work I do, you know, mainly with stones. But I train dumbbell as well. My my personal best on the dumbbell is overhead. The press is 113 kilo, the most I ever lifted, one hand. Very 113. Oh wow! Which I mean, not bad for. I mean, I mean, I'm natural and I'm only 255 pounds. You know, I'm not like a giant. giant. Yeah. So it's nearly my body weight. I'm just. I'm not big, you know. So. <laughs> Very cool. Yeah, and I've I've seen um, you do a lot of uh, like one arm pressing feats in your shows as well. Yeah, nearly in every show I do human dumbbell, human dumbbell. You know, lifting. I've even seen you do it, John, several times. <laughs> lifting people with the bell, you know, with the weightlifting bell, and just lifting with one hand. But yeah. usually that we lift a bit l lighter, like up to 80, 90 kilos at most. Because it's much harder than lifting a, you know, obviously with a dumbbell with a bar, it's much easier to lift than a person with the belt. So. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. The person, uh, the weight doesn't. Um, it never goes where you want it to. <laughs> no, no. It's very, it's very awkward. Very awkward. <laughs> and I think you do. Um, I've seen uh, like a, a pinky lift um, overhead with with a keg or a propane tank or. or uh, with the, yeah, gas bottle, that, the gas bottle. They're usually 25 kilos, but they're, they're a bit awkward, you know, to lift. 
On my pinky, I think I can press about 43 kilo the most I've ever pressed on my pinky. 43. Oh, wow. That's that's pretty good. <laughs> that's uh, pinky lifts are hard. Pinky lifts are hard. Painful, painful. <laughs> painful oh yeah, for lifts. sure. <clears throat> so, um, what do you think your favorite uh, feat is right now that that you're doing in your shows and whatnot? Uh, I like them all, really. You know, I like everything because uh, everything is different. You know, I, I enjoy everything really. Yeah. I enjoy it. That's cool. Yeah. Um, what about the what about the crowds? Um, do you kind of have something that uh, that you end the shows with as like the big finale or um, something uh, along those lines? Uh, it depends. Sometimes we have big crowds, you know. Sometimes we have smaller crowds. Depends on the event, like and and you know how many people are there. Sometimes we have big crowds, though. So sometimes. We have smaller crowds. He, he he did Facebook recently, and he added me. On